All right, in this geek tip, I want to show you how to back up your files in Windows 8 with file history. File history is new to Windows 8 and Windows Server 2012. It actually replaces backup and restore. So let's go over to file history. We're going to get there by right clicking on the blank spot of the start menu and bringing up the app command bar. We're going to left click all apps. We're going to scroll over and we're going to find control panel. We're going to left click on it. We'll actually find it under system security. Save backup copies of your files with file history. You can also, if you view it by large or small icons, you'll find it has its own link right there. But let's go back to the category view and let's select and say backup copies of your files. Now, file history has a couple of cool features. Um, number one, it saves previous versions. Uh, you can actually set up a time as to how often it saves versions of files. Let's say you have an application crash, the file you're working on gets corrupted you can actually go back to the last saved version. Also, file history will only back up files on your, in your libraries, your contacts, your favorites, your Microsoft SkyDrive, and on your desktop. So if you have files you want to back up that are not in one of these locations, you have to create a library for it. Also, file history will only save to an external hard drive or a network drive and as you can see I actually have a shared network folder on a network drive but let me go ahead I want to show you the advanced settings as I was telling you before it actually has a time limit on how often it saves file versions it actually gives you the option of how big your file history is and how often it purges or keeps your file versions which is really cool so let's go back now I want to show you the how to restore personal files so we'll go over here we click on restore personal files and actually we'll bring up the different dates that have been saved so I've got a couple of them of them in here we'll go ahead and just kind of browse through you can actually see the different dates and uh, the different folders that were backed up and we'll take a look at the different versions that are in there actually I have a, a sample text file that I've actually saved several different times just to uh, just to uh, sh show off the file history program. So say if I had an application crash and my text file got corrupted, I could just go back to the last point in which they were saved and restore it back. I think that's a, a pretty cool item. So that's pretty much how you use file history in Windows 8. For more geek tips, go on over to geeksinphoenix.com and peruse through our geek tips. We have them for Windows 8, Windows 7, Vista, XP. We've got some Android stuff there, all sorts of stuff. So when you get a chance, go on over to geeksinphoenix.com and peruse through the site. Okay, till then, hope you have a great day. Thanks.